Hi friends, in this video, we are discussing about the sleeper and rail fastening. What is the railway sleeper? Railway sleeper are the component on which the rails are arranged with proper gauge. This sleeper generally rests on ballast and is also called ties in some region. In load from rail, when train passes, is taken by these sleepers and is distributed it to the ballast uniformly. Sleeper. Sleepers are members generally laid transverse to the rail on which are rail are supported and fixed to transfer the load from rails to the ballast. Subgrade below. Next functions of sleeper. Functions of sleeper. The main functions of sleeper are as follows. To hold rails in tight condition. To maintain correct gauge and alignment. To retain packing underneath sleepers. To provide firm and even support to rail. To transfer load from rails to the wider area of ballast. To add as elastic medium between rails and ballast. Providing longitudinal and lateral stability to the permanent way. These are the functions of the sleepers. Type of sleeper. Depending on type of material, there are following type of sleeper. Wooden sleeper, cast iron sleeper, steel stuff sleeper, concrete sleeper. Wooden Cast iron and uh, steel trough sleeper have uh, become obsolete and at present uh, concrete sleepers are being used widely for certain specific location example girder bridges point and crossing etc stress composite sleepers are being gradually introduced in Indian railway in this video we discussing about only the concrete sleeper. Concrete sleeper are again classified into two. Reinforced concrete sleeper and pre-stressed concrete sleeper. That is a PSE sleeper. Concrete sleeper. Concrete sleeper are made of a strong homogeneous material. Impervious to affect moisture and is unaffected by the chemical attack of atmospheric gases or subsoil salt. Concrete sleeper first laid in Karai yard, Chansi Gallier section on Central Railway. Amongst the monoblock and tin block concrete sleeper type, Indian Railway uses the monoblock pre-stressed concrete sleepers predominantly. This PSE sleeper provides longitudinal and lateral stability required for LWR and due to the flat bottom. These sleepers are suitable for mechanized tamping. Next, advantages of concrete sleeper over other type of sleeper. Great stability. Track geometry maintained for much longer duration, hence economical. Best suited for machine maintenance. Suitable for track circuiting area. No chances of damage by fire or corrosion. No possibility of theft. No possibility of theft. No chances of gauge widening. 60 kg slippers can be used for 52 kg rail. Best suited for LWR track. Best performance of points and crossing, SCJ, guard rail, level crossings, check rail in curve. These are the main advantages of the concrete sleeper. Next we discussed about the disadvantages. Disadvantage. Handling and laying is difficult being heavy. Damage is very heavy in case of derailment. No or 
negligible scrap value no scrap value not suitable for manual packing that is a beta packing mono block pre stressed concrete sleepers indian railways uses the mono block pre stressed concrete sleepers predominantly the psc sleepers are manufactured to conform rdso specification number irst 39 for plain track and irst 145 turnout sleeper total length is 2750 mm main features of psc 1214 sleepers length 2750 mm weight is approximately 286 kg distance between insert at rail seat 148 mm or 162 mm reinforcement 18 numbers of 3 mm dia high tension steel strands each strand to be tensioned with a an initial tensile force 2730 kg concrete grade m40 concrete is to be controlled quality with a minimum 28 crushing strength of 525 kg cm square service life 2000 gmt or 35 years whichever is earlier two block rcc sleeper for broad gauge yards a design for a two block rcc sleeper for bg yards has been standardized by rdso as per drawing number rdso t2521 for extensive trials on indian railways main features of two block rcc sleeper considering low speeds in yards lanes and less impact effort the rail seat design load has been taken only as 10 10 without any lateral thrust size of rail seat top width into bottom width into depth is equal to 22 cm into 30 cm 17 cm overall length of sleeper is equal to 247.5 cm the weight of sleeper 170 kg main reinforcement in each block at the top 58 mm diameter steel bars at the bottom 2 mm diameter steel bars the fastening uses are steel clips and a spring washer with a screw fitted to a polythene dowel concrete sleepers can be identified by the drawing number and code of sleeper manufacturer with year of manufacture engraved on the top and surface of sleepers All the PSC slippers are tested for electrical resistance at the time of manufacture and slippers are marked by paint with FTC to indicate fit for track circuiting and NFTC to indicate not fitted for track circuit relocation to identification FTC and non FTC that is a NFTC drawing number of various type of concrete sleeper ordinary PSC sleeper T2495 T2496 T8527 another one is the slack cage sleeper please refer the table for more detail sleeper for guard rail and bridge approaches sleeper for lc sleeper for scj 
sleeper four points and crossing shallow depth sleeper sleeper for re railing ramp F full uh, drawing number are given in in table please refer for further detail laying of sleepers sleepers shall be laid square to rails on the straight and radially on curve line the sleeper spacing should be marked on outer rail in case of curved track closer spacing should be provided at joint sleepers of fish plated joint and between joint sleepers and shoulder sleeper rail joint should be suspended track should be deep screened cuttings having rocky bed should have clean ballast cushion of at least 250 mm on arc bridges formation cover minimum 1 meter on other bridge ballast cushion not less than 300 mm sleeper density the sleeper density is expressed as the number of sleeper per kilometer of a track and is fixed taking into consideration the maximum permissible speed and the traffic density of a session minimum sleeper density the minimum sleeper density for all track renewals that is complete track renewals and true sleeper renewal doubling gauge conversion new lane construction work for main lane shall be 1616 numbers per kilometer and for loop lane and sidings per permissible speed up to 50 km page it shall be 1514 numbers per kilometer for sidings with permissible speed more than 50 km page minimum sleeper density shall be 1616 number per kilometer another thing not higher sleeper density may be provided with the approval of principal chief engineer where concrete sleepers are required to be laid in unavoidable circumstances the stbr track the sleeper spacing including at fish plated joint shall be kept uniform in addition 1 meter long fish plate be provided at fish plated joints what is the sleeper density sleeper density is expressed as the number of sleeper per kilometer of track fastening on psc sleepers only approved type of fittings and elastic fastening shall be used with the concrete sleeper the traditional rigid type of the fastening are not able to meet the challenges posed by heavy dynamic forces and become loose under the high frequency vibration hence elastic fastenings are found to be very suitable for high speed tracks elastic fastening an elastic rail clip assembly for concrete sleepers for each rail seat consist of two malleable cast iron insert which are cast in concrete during manufacture of the sleeper two pandro clip or erc two insulating liners one elastic pad or grooved rubber sole plates grs fastenings all the components which together form the structural connection between rail and sleeper is called fastening general function and requirement of fastening system to absorb rail forces elastically and transfer to sleeper sufficient clamping force in all situation for longitudinal and lateral resistance 
even in the bond condition limit breathing length or limit gaps in case of frail fracture to damp vibration and impact to retain track gauge and rail inclination to provide electrical insulation these are the function of the fastening next elastic rail clip erc manufactured from silico manganese spring steel bar next function to keep a sufficient continuous tow load on the rail under the static and dynamic condition to ensure no separation between rail and rubber pad to ensure that the uplift of the rail under the precaution wave is kept to minimum provide creep resistance keep contact with the rail at all times distribute load uniformly prevents crushing of sleeper seat absorb and damp high frequency vibration these are the functions of the erc please refer the table for the more details about the erc and their salient features rubber pad rubber pad is a provided between the rail side to the sleeper and has the following function function absorbs shocks and damp out vibration molecules brought closer under force energy dissipation when force is removed increase frictional resistance to longitudinal and lateral movement of rail distribute load uniformly over sleeper provide electric insulation between rail and sleeper prevent abrasion of the bottom surface of rail reduce noise level grooved pads mostly grooved type is used by indian railway because help in lateral expansion higher deflection possible with thinner pads greater re resilience and distribution of shear forces grooved pads laid in such a way that grooves are parallel to rail composite grsp composite gr sp grooved rubber sole plate with two layers of different type of rubber are developed which has the top layer having harder material that is a higher modulus of elasticity while bottom is softer material the harder layer should be kept in contact with rail and softer layer is more sticking to the sleeper in this table containing the different type of the rubber pad number different type of sleeper using different type of the uh, rubber pad next composite grsp for rt2496 sleeper rt2618 used for rt2495 sleeper rt8327 used for rt8527 rt8528 used liners are the fitting used in the congestion with the, the grsp cgrsp and the rail on the both side of the rail foot to achieve the correct gauge to provide for the correct deflection of the erc for the descent tow load the combination liners also allow flexibility to use lighter rail section on the sleeper mean for heavier in rail section function of liner distribution of tow load over the larger area allows use of the different rail section on the same sleeper provide insulation between rail and insert 
റിക്വയർമെൻ്റ് ഓഫ് എ ലൈൻ ആറും പ്രോപ്പർ സ്ലോപ്പ് ടു മാച്ച് വിത്ത് റെയിൽ ഫ്രൂട്ട് സ്ലോപ്പ് വെർട്ടിക്കൽ ലെഗ് ഓഫ് എ ലൈനർ ഷുഡ് ഫിറ്റ് പ്രോപ്പർലി ബിറ്റ്വീൻ റെയിൽ ആൻഡ് എം സി ഐ ബാർ എസ് ജി സി ഐ ഇൻസേർട്ട് ടു മെയിൻ്റെ ഗേറ്റ്സ് ഈസി ടു മാനുഫാക്ചർ ആൻഡ് ഫിറ്റ്സ് അറ്റ് സൈറ്റ് ടൈപ്പ് ഓഫ് ലൈനർ ലൈനേഴ്സ് ആർ മെയ്ഡ് അപ്പ് ഓഫ് ടു മെറ്റീരിയൽ ഗ്ലാസ് ഫീൽഡ് നൈലോൺ ജി എഫ് എൻ എൽ ലൈനേഴ്സ് സിക്സ്റ്റി സിക്സ് പെർസെൻറ്റേജ് നൈലോൺ ആൻഡ് തേർട്ടി ത്രീ പെർസെൻറ്റേജ് ഗ്ലാസ് ഫൈബർ ദി ജി എഫ് എൻ എൽ ലൈനേഴ്സ് ആർ ജനറലി യൂസ് ഇൻ ട്രാക്ക് സർക്യൂട്ട് ലൊക്കേഷൻ മെറ്റൽ ലൈനേഴ്സ് പ്രൊവൈഡഡ് ഓൺ നോൺ ട്രാക്ക് സർക്യൂട്ട് ഏരിയാസ് കട്ട് ലൈനേഴ്സ് ഷാൽ ബി യൂസ്ഡ് വിത്ത് ഇ ആർ സി ജെ ക്ലിപ്പ് അറ്റ് ഫിഷ് പ്ലേറ്റഡ് ജോയിൻറ്റ് ഓർ ഗ്ലൂഡ് ജോയിൻറ്റ് In this table containing some of the commonly used liners and diff- for different rail section and different sleeper. If you like my video, please like and subscribe my channel. Thank you.